I need to go home again. God damn it. God damn it. I need to go through here again. Um, you know what I could do? I wonder if I could do this. I don't know if... There's actually a way out over here. Like, where's this go? Can I see? It just kind of goes to the front again. Like, I swear to God that there was a... Another, like, area that I could go to, but I can't see it. Alright, well, whatever. Let's just, let's just go at the front door. It's fine. It's fine. So yeah, that's, that's how that came out. It's not in this one, I don't think, unless... Where does this go? I know in one of the train stations it has like an exit out into the sewers, but I don't think that it's this train station. I think it's a different train station. Yeah, this just goes out there, which I don't really care about. And this just goes in here, which I've already been to. No use to me at all. Let's just, let's just go. We have to we have to sneak past here again, but that's okay. I can do that. I can sneak. It's what I've been doing this whole time. I'm gonna go right now. I'm gonna go right now. I'm gonna go right now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, 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 I don't know who that was. But he almost saw me. There is some over there who's kind of looking this way. I don't know if I can. I can. Nope. Alright, that was a lot easier than... Uh, than it has been in the past. Which is great. I'll make sure you get the first door from the door. Don't even see me. Oh yeah, I'm on the top floor. Jensen? Why do you live on the top floor? Why is my door open? Oh, yeah, because Alex is here. Hi. Hi, Alex. We got it wrong, Adam. Brown's financial prospects aren't as rosy as we thought. He stands to lose trillions if the Human Restoration Act passes. That doesn't make any sense. Millions of displaced dogs will flock to Rabia. And the city can't support them. Brown's been selling investors a pumped-up dream. The corporate city-state where like-minded individuals govern themselves while investors reap the profits. Kind of goes against the idea of a one-world government. Yeah, and if it fails, so does Brown, the Santo Group, and anyone else standing in the Illuminati's way. So they Illuminati. want to kill a competing dream and get rid of their augmented problem in one fell swoop. I take it Brown's been campaigning against the act? And unlike Rucker, he's got the money and influence to stop it. What about the orchid sample I gave you? Marchenko's smuggling more of it into London. Were you able to analyze it? That's some pretty sick shit, man. Far as we can tell, it targets a specific protein sequence in the body and deletes it. But without that sequence, the immune system goes into overdrive, attacking and rejecting critical organs within minutes. Rucker's death must have been horrible. It was. The way it hit him, it looked like his augmentations were being forced out of his body. Like he was experiencing a ramped up form of rejection syndrome. The orchid's an og killer? How did you survive it? Yeah, that's my question. I suspect it's an everyone killer. But something in my DNA must be resistant to it. My body doesn't reject augments, Alex. I've never needed neuropazine. Maybe that's the key. No neuropazine dependency? Jesus, how's life at the top, man? You gotta be what? One in a billion? Still, don't go testing this theory out. 
You might not be so lucky next it time. It did knock me out. Make me weak for a little bit. Darknet posted pictures of Rucker's corpse. If Brown and all his elegant, fancy potential investors get dosed, and Picus News broadcasts images of them, it's gonna send a message. I'd better warn Miller. You can stay here if you want, till the curfew is lifted. I can take care of myself. But when the task force hits London, keep me in the loop. Not sure what I can do, but... Good luck, Adam. And be safe. Okay. Miller, it's Jensen. Is McCready still working on that plan for London? Because there's another variable to consider. You can brief him yourself at TF-29's airfield. We're mobilizing. Copy that. How do I get there? All right. Damn curfew's still in effect. So if you can get to Chicane's place, you'll fly you to it. Miller out. <laughs> All right. Well, I knew that was going to happen. All right. Let's go. I don't think there's any reason to stay down here unless... <sighs> Maybe Alex did something in my apartment. She, like, hid, hid some things. I know. This is just Richard's, <laughs> Richard's e-book. Nah, there ain't nothing here, I don't think. I mean, there could be something up here. I don't think I ever actually came up here. But there's nothing, there's nothing up here. Oh, there we go. There, is, there are, like, these boards up here, but I, I mean, there were people in here at some point that I had to fight off, so I imagine this, these boards are kind of for them. I mean, I'll look around and see if I see any loot, but I, I don't think that there's any loot around here. I mean, we just knocked those those suckers out. Okay. Let's go. Let's go fight the Illuminati. Them, they're uh, Illuminatis, you know? They're, uh, they're bad guys. They're a bunch of bad guys. The Illuminatis. Uh, where am I going? I mean, I know where I'm going, I just, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Uh, I just need to get over there. Do I, do I need to go to TF-29 at all? I guess not. I did get a point. I'll, I'll, I'll see about that point in a minute. Yeah, I've done everything. There's, like, nothing else to do. So I'm just following the main story. Let's... Let's point it. Let's point it up. I have one. Do I want to finish out my energy? It's tempting. Um... Or do I want to? I don't really want any of this stuff anymore. I, I have the things that I want. Um, I mean, the nano blade is cool, but um, it's very, very lethal. Uh, I have I have this, which is great. I have do I have um don't have flash suppressant, which might be useful. Uh, so basically, it's either flash suppressant or um, energy, or possibly my last um, inventory increase, which I don't think I really need, to be honest. It depends. Am I gonna am I gonna get to a point where I'm gonna get like a rocket launcher and want to keep that, like 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 the like the first game? I think I might, you know. So, we're gonna go ahead and do that. Just in case. Just in case I have need of a rocket launcher. We're gonna do that. Uh, we have to just go back. Alright. I probably could have gone, but now I have to wait. Because this guy's about to turn around and come back. Come 
Eyes open. Eyes open. Stay sharp. Eyes closed. Dull down. If any orc makes it here, they'll be sorry. I have I have been sorry in the past for getting your ire, uh, officer. Okay. Forgot that he turned around. I want a lawyer. Yeah, I mean, if I was wearing my coat, Craig, he, they wouldn't be able to see all these augments that I have on. Or not augments, all my um, all my gear, all my guns. I don't actually have a grenade launcher, though. I mean, I only have this Trank gun, which is, I think, needlessly large. Like, I figure, I, I think a Trank gun only needs to be about this big, you know? It doesn't have to be, like, rifle-sized. And then I have the, uh, the stun gun, stun gun, and the uh, uh, 10 mil which um, has EMP rounds on it. Augs only. You know what? Screw, screw your Augs only bullshit. I'm going here. I'm going to save just in case. I'm going to go here. <laughs> if I have to walk, I'm walking down the human side. The non-Aug side. I could conceal a battle rifle or a grenade launcher if I had Alex's cloaking technology, which I could get if I wanted to spend the points on it, but I don't know. It would make things a lot easier. And yet I choose not to do it. Why do I choose not to do it? Who knows? Who knows why I do the things that I do? Honestly, who knows? I don't know. Shit. That guy's gonna hear me if I do that. I forgot. Makes too much noise. Am I out? Can I look at the map now? I can't look at the map now. Um, I'm probably gonna end up having to go around. Maybe not. I might be able to get up there this way. Wait for both of these guys to turn around. You from my voice. I knew when Rocker died, something would spark. Nothing to report. Hello? Ah, they saw me. They saw me. No, hold on. I can't. I can't, though. I can't do that. I. I. I messed up. I should have hidden more. I should have, I should have, I was trying to go for it when I should not have gone for it. That's like, that's like the secret to these stealth games, right? You, uh, you have to know when to be patient and know when to be bold. I knew when a rocker died, something would spark. And that was a case of me not knowing. Making a mistake. I'll try not to make a mistake again. Shit. Think I have a leak in my boot. You have a leak in your boot? Aren't you supposed to, like, walk over there at some point? 
Maybe I do just have to go around the other way. I was hoping I could just go like right here, but I don't think that's gonna happen. I feel like the big guy isn't doing what he usually does. I feel like the big guy is looking over here more often than he's than he's supposed to. Didn't he like turn the other way at some point? He's not doing it right now. They really believe a riot can spread all the way into the city. I feel like the game is screwing with me right now. I feel like the game is like, oh, you want to go that way? Nah, you don't want to go that way. You really don't. You really don't want to go that way. You know what? Fine. I won't go that way. They really believe a riot can spread all the way. Fine, game. You want me to go this way? I'll go this way. Fine. I miss my jacket though, it's raining out here. I really wish I had it. I could go down that way. I did deactivate the um, turret, but at the same time, there's a guy right there, and I don't really feel like it's really going to help. Where's the thing here? Down? Must be down. Turret down there. Oh no! No way! Come on! What saw me? Oh, you guys saw me. Okay. The map in this game is a little bit bad. The mini map, I mean. Did they take his coat when he was knocked out at Garm? Probably, yeah. I would imagine they did. I don't know who's wearing it. It's not going to fit Marchenko. Okay, if you want to go this way. Maybe I do want to go this way. At least I'm nice and warm here. So I have to make it through this little alleyway. Without being spotted. Jesus Christ, I don't know how this is going to work. Can I... No, the exterior shields are, re are out, which means I can hide up there, but not from those guys. I have to hide from this guy. I think I'm just going to wait until this guy turns around, and then I'm going to go. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So now I'm in, like, an actual good place. All I need to do is just wait here for a second, and then I'll be able to go. God. Get off there, Jensen. Get off, get off there. No, just, just, no, just get off. Okay. God. Stop sticking to the walls, Jensen. You're not Spider-Man. Alright. So he's around here somewhere, right? Um, McCready? There's Chicane. Where's McCready? He's in there. Am I... Oops. I have... 
Just says meet Chicane. I guess maybe McCready's already at London. That's fine. That's fine. I just want to make sure I'm not like missing him here. Hey man. Miller's not here yet. He's already left for the main hangars with McCready's team. Yeah. We're supposed to rendezvous with them there. You ready to go? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, let's go. Oh my god. Loud. Loud cutscenes. Didn't I have this problem in the first one, too? It's fine. Two days? How long does it take us to get from to Prague from London? To, from, to London from Prague. B. I understand that. There are hundreds of lives at risk. I hope you're wrong about this, Jensen. So do I. Fine. Fine. Have your men pull back until I can talk to him myself. Miller out. Changing plans. Mac, you and your team will rendezvous with our London division. Secure the perimeter until I tell you to come back in. Jensen, you and I are on the roof. Is there a problem? Map it up, gentlemen. Approaching the target building now. Get your coat. You're gonna need it. <laughs> That's what I've been saying! I don't have to tell you what's happening. You know the drill. There are people down there. Radical, augmented people who've been sidelined by this world and who think the only way to stop the oppression is by tearing down everything in their way. Their grievances may be just, maybe they should be heard, but never on these terms. The world may be going to shit, but we're here to stand against the chaos. Every one of the guests down there are counting on us to keep them safe. Let's make sure we do. Some interesting looking buildings, I wonder who they belong to. Apex Center. Dr. Miller, I'm Nathaniel Brown. How's it going? Thank you for agreeing to handle this discreetly. We didn't exactly have a choice. You threatened to invoke the Corporate Sovereignty Act. I gave your London division a full day to sweep for explosives. They found nothing. It's not just bombs we're concerned with. I've also replaced all the food and beverage brought in ex regards from Tarvis Security Services and uh, order the men to work with your team when it arrives. Okay, I don't know if that's a good idea. I'm taking this threat very seriously. Then why not cancel the event? This isn't the first time extremists have threatened to tear down the Safe Harbor Initiative. Pro-Og supporters think we're profiting from their misery, promoting more failures like Gollum City. Well, anti-Og racists can't stand the thought of any augmented person living in peace. Canceling this event will only embolden all of them. Hmm. Educate. Let's be an educator. The men planning to attack here tonight are no ordinary extremists. They murdered Talus Rucker. And they want to frame the Augmented Rights Coalition if their attack tonight succeeds. Is this true? How do you know it? How does it matter? We're here because of a credible threat against you and your Safe Harbor Convention. These men are out to stop you. They know you've been campaigning against the Human Restoration Act. They need it to pass. They don't care how many lives they destroy as long as that happens. But we do. It's Agent Jensen, isn't it? 
Right. David Seraph told me about you. You might not believe this, Agent, but I'm also trying to save lives tonight. You know Seraph? The lives of your people. Several members of the UN Security Council are on my guest list tonight. I plan to convince them just how wrong the act really is. Tell us Rucker couldn't stop it from passing. But I can. Where are you meeting then? In a secure conference room off the reception hall. The men from your London division have already cleared it. Doesn't matter. I want to see this room myself. And I want Agent Jensen here to coordinate with Tavos security, while the rest of my team re-examines the building. Discreetly, of course. The head of our Tarvis division is Liam Slater. He's waiting for your man to join him in the central security office. Okay, so I'm gonna go fight Liam. Go see him, Agent. <laughs> and then... McCready and me in the loop. Mr. Brown, if you'll show me that conference room. I mean, we know for a fact that, that Miller is in on whatever this is, right? We don't know what he's going to do, though. We don't know how involved he's going to make himself here. Um, for all I know, he has the friggin' stuff on him, or, like, the activation key, like, on him, for all we know. 